Storm team continues to take us on a colorful cruise through western Colorado's most radiant mountain towns to give us a tour of what autumn has to offer. This week, we head to Glenwood Springs with Josephine Sage. Well, of course, it's hard to pinpoint the exact date that the colors turn, uh, but in Glenwood Springs, we're above 5,700 feet, and so normally it'll change at the end of this month, September, into uh, mid-October is when we get the biggest color change. Lisa Langer, the Director of Tourism for Visit Glenwood Springs, tells us about the wide variety of fall activities to do during this colorful time of year, with some stretching into the winter season. We have all kinds of wonderful things coming up. One of the first autumn activities is the Wild and Scenic Film Festival, hosted at the Vaudeville Review Theater on September 28th. The last weekend in September is the start of Oktoberfest for Glenwood Springs, too. It's set to run on Saturdays only September 30th, October 7th, and October 14th. For added fun, Glenwood Adventure Park is hosting the celebration. Admission is just the cost of a gondola ticket to the actual park. Also happening October 14th, Sunlight Ski Resort hosts its Oktoberfest. You can buy tickets on their website. Oktoberfest isn't the only way to enjoy the fall colors, though. There are so many hiking trails in and around Glenwood Springs, and there are at least a dozen trailheads that you can access from right from within town. One of the easiest and most beautiful trails is the Doc Holiday Trail. You'll learn all kinds of history about the town and its first settlers here. Along this trail, you'll also find the Linwood Cemetery. During the last two weekends of October, the local historical society gives ghost tours with a bonus. Actors dress in period accurate clothes and stand by certain graves to tell local pioneer stories. Who knows, you may even meet the ghost of Doc Holiday, who is rumored to be buried here. Another favorite haunt of ghost hunters is the beautiful and historic Hotel Colorado, which always dresses up for the holidays. But if you're not into ghosts, spiking through the canyon is another breathtaking way to see the colors. The Glenwood Hot Springs Pool or Iron Mountain Hot Springs are another relaxing way to enjoy the autumn season and ease into winter if that's more your speed. It's lovely to be in the warm water and have the snow falling on top of you. Just a few beautiful and fun ways to celebrate the change in seasons. With that in mind though, please drive carefully and obey traffic laws if you drive through Glenwood Canyon. Remember uh, to get your snow tires and you know get those put on I would say by the end of October. No matter what kind of fall or upcoming winter fun you like most, you're sure to enjoy the beauty of one of Western's Colorado's most lively towns. Reporting for KREX 5 News, Josephine Sage.